Afterwards, you, you called out George St. Pierre, which was a little bit surprising for all of us. Um, why is that a fight that interests you? And are you saying that you would move up to 170 and fight him there? Are you inviting him to come down to 155 and challenge for your title? What's, what's the plan? No, please. No 170 with George St. Pierre, no. You know, like, um, when I talk with my father, like, one year ago, he told me his dream fight, me versus George St. Pierre. Because I remember when I grew up, like, like 11, 12 years ago, when I'm competing in Combat Sambo Dagestan Championship, like junior Combat Sambo Dagestan Championship, he fight for the UFC title. And like when I grew up, I watched his fights, like all fights with my father. And he, he is greatest athlete who ever competed in UFC. Middleweight, welterweight champion. And I hear about like he wanna come and fight in 155, take this belt, make history, become UFC three division champion, you know? Why not me versus James, George St. Pierre? Like, like if I beat Connor or if I beat George St. Pierre, which one is better for my legacy? Maybe for money is Connor, but for legacy is George St. Pierre. But we don't know about money too because me versus George St. Pierre is gonna be big, big fight, you know. And but only respect, only respect. But if you guys ask me about hey, he have to come back or no? I'm gonna say no. He's 35 years old. He already greatest athlete UFC, you know, and why he need come back? For what? And uh, that's it. Hey, last